Hi guys, so I'm back with another, this is going to be a DIY um, update slash a small haul. So this is a mirror box that I created. I followed Sharon's tutorial on how to create it. So I think it's how many pieces? 12? Yeah. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then 2 on the sides, okay? So the mirrors came from Dollar Tree. And these flowers, which are really, really pretty, came from Amazon. And they are $7.99 for $50. So this is $50. Now, there are some spaces because I had to purchase more of them. And they took longer to come in. This set only took about two weeks to come in. I brought two I brought um two packages of 50, so a hundred, and they took like almost a month to come in. So sometimes you get things very quickly and sometimes it takes a bit longer. So it's a very beautiful mirror box. I will show you what that will look like and where it will be placed. But I just wanted you guys to kind of get a, a good look at it. Very beautiful. And I decided to go with all white because I felt like it just looks very um, classic. Mirror box. So this was what? What did I say? 12, the foam at the bottom, 13, and then 7, right? So 13 and 7, right under $20, right? So not bad for that because you will find these in home goods for like $80. So this was very, a very good deal. So here are the flowers. This is what they look like when they come packaged to you. They actually have stems. They're very thin. I'm sorry for the crackling of the paper. Plastic rather. I'll take one out for you. So this is what they look like. So you can play with them and bend them to make them look how you want. So they have a very soft feel. They're called foam. Foam or real feel. They look decent. You could definitely tell it's a, a fake flower, but they're nice, but very thin. This will be hard to, well, I won't say it won't be hard to, but um, they're very easy to bend and manipulate. And actually, I didn't even cut these down. I just folded them like so, and I just stuck them into the foam, um, the foam blocks from Dollar Tree. And it was easier because I doubled the, the width and the strength of the stem by folding it in half if I just would have put it put them in how they came, it would have been harder for me to have more control and manipulation over the flowers. All right. So that's a pack of 50. Here's my other pack of 50. I'm going to be doing a DIY with that. And then I made this little mirror box here and I followed um, Design fun, design, design fun, design for fun. I followed her tutorial on how to create this. And actually, I forgot the price of the foam, so it was a little bit more than it was like $25, let's say. These flowers are from the Dollar Tree, and I just put a little bit of diamond wrap around them. All right, and quickly, another. DIY, which these are not finished, guys. Not finished. Keep that in mind. So, <laughs> I found this really awesome channel. And her name is, um, Petal, Petals Bless. I'll try to leave her link below. I need to go back and thoroughly to get rid of the rest of the grout. So, <laughs> I bought these um, glass cylinders from Joann's, and they were $30, and I used the 40% off coupon. 
I then bought mirror from um, Walmart, like the the lean uh, the, the mirrors that you can lean against the doors, the door mirrors, the five dollar ones. I think they're five ninety eight, so six dollars. So I bought two of those. I broke up the mirror. I glued it to the the clear vase. Then I went in with uh, white grout. Now, what I would do differently is use way less grout. It's pretty hard to get rid of putting too much grout in, okay? It's easier to have to go back and add more grout than to take away after it dries. So that's what I'm currently working on is trying to, I just need to make the time to finish up this project and get all the grout out of the little pieces. You see like there's grout here, grout there. And this is before I found all those mosaic vases. But I'm still going to keep these because I put a lot of work into these. <laughs> and I put money into them. So I'm definitely going to keep them because I think they are super pretty. And I definitely will find somewhere for them. And they're very tall. Okay? So I just wanted to show you this. This is a very nice project. And I will show you the end results and where they live. And just really quickly, I wanted to show you... Um, Two more little mirror trays I found from Ross. These were $9.99. And I will show you what I plan on doing with those. I have purchased two. You see those? One, two. And last but not least, I purchased this apothecary jar. And this was from home goods and it was $12.99 and I'm trying to think if that's everything which I think it is so I will see you guys soon thank you for all of my new subscribers thank you for all of my subscribers who have been with me since my first video <laughs> and just for um you know supporting me thank you and have a blessed day